guys, this is Rosie the Cutie 1995 and welcome back to Thomas Adventures Review Time. And of course I had to do episode 2 with Henrietta. Her first, well let's just say adventure slash take and play release. <laughs> I've been saying I wanted them to make uh, Henrietta in take and play but no, well kind of. But they've done it in, in adventures which I accept. Thumbs up, Mattel! <laughs> so, without further ado, let's get cracking! So, nothing much to say on the packaging. Um, with all the characters now, with their packaging, it's all like this blue with all the different symbols on like a train and a T and a number one and a top hat and everything else. But it has different character CGI promos, like there's Henrietta there. Looks cool. On the back. Nothing to explain. So, we better get her out. Here is Henrietta, and she is really light. Really, really light. And I was actually pretty glad they actually made Henrietta because I was going to use an Ursel Henrietta, but they've done it. They've actually done it. So, you can see here, she, her buffers are actually painted, which is quite a shock, really, because. Normally they don't paint the rolling stock, well, I think they do, but they're not bothered to paint the engines, I don't know why. <laughs> so there's her windows here. Um, she's really, really light, by the way, it's really, really light. Um, I'm surprised they haven't done any windows, like, here or something, like, like on her back or something, or doesn't matter which way Henrietta is, really. You can always just do a remake of a classic episode, which Henrietta is, not, is faceless. <laughs> Still, she looks awesome. So there's her back, her, not her back, her, her her name on the bottom. When was this done? In 2016, made in Thailand. <laughs> and of course, the um, the the couplings can now rotate now. Same with the same with the back as well. So that is neat. And I actually got Frankie with me here, so I am very, very excited to see how these are going to connect. So, we better see. Oh, it's a good thing this is like that way and that way, so let's see. Oh, that's a good click. Oh, wow, that is awesome. They can connect really good, and look at that. They don't, they can actually connect like that. Look at that. That is neat. I I am loving this. I really am. I think this is the best thing that Mattel's done with the magnets. They've got rid of the round ones and they switched them to these hooks. This feels amazing. <laughs> this actually feels pretty good. So awesome. So that's my review on the Adventures Henrietta. I know it's pretty short, but it was hard to explain because... It's a coach and a rolling stock, so... <laughs> but I am so happy they've actually done Henrietta in another merchandise. So, people can actually remove the faces now and put them on the backmans or wooden... I don't know. And of course I didn't have Toby in Adventures form, so... I had to use Frankie at the back <laughs> for now. So she's stealing Henrietta. <laughs> um... So that's it really, so pop a comment below guys, which do you like, are you actually very 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 happy that they've made Henrietta and do you think they might do some different more like more rolling stock maybe from the CGI arena when like the characters have appeared maybe like the slip coaches, what do you think? So this is Rosie the Cutie 1995 signing off and bye! Thank you.